Hello guys, welcome to my blog. Today we're gonna to talk about the 10 ways to be happy. We wanna be happy guys. Okay, so it's so easy to get negative when things are not going well, to feel sad when things are not going well. So it is a choice. It is about choosing to be happy. It is about looking at looking at perspective, you know, looking at another person, looking at the world, looking at every situation. And then you realize that, hmm, I don't have it that bad. So we have to choose happiness. It is a choice. So here are my 10 ways, 10 tips, ways that we know already is just a good reminder. Okay. So number one, let's celebrate small victories so somebody gives you a compliment at work you finish a task you make a phone call on your to-do list these are things that you can celebrate so important so small victories be your own cheerleader number two practice gratitude so by the end of the day by the end of the night we're tired we fall on the bed we're ready for sleep but guess what something that I get, I've gotten in, in the habit of doing. I kind of go through my day, I think of the things that I'm grateful for. You realize that you have things that uh, happen during the day or things that happened that night or things that just happened that you're grateful for. Then you be grateful and gratefulness is a great way to count your blessings and be happy. Number three, So monitor your screen time. So work demands you to be, to check your phone regularly. We need to get the news. We need to get the news from, from TV. So all electronics that connect us to the internet have this addictive nature. We're addicted to it, but it's stressful. So it is important that we disconnect so so important i i find myself monitoring how much tv time how much phone time how much ipad time how much how much uh, uh computer time so you manage this you a lot uh 30 minute um periods where you go and check them to so i find that this makes me breathe slower and doesn't stress me as much. So that is a good way to handle it. So, so really monitor your screen time. Number four, of course, exercise is a big one. So you hear this all the time. I'm not the first person who's gonna say this. As we move, we feel better, okay? So you're not gonna run, if, if, if it's not your goal, you know, you're not gonna run a marathon. So simple, baby steps so go for a walk choose to take the stairs instead of the elevator all this get your mind get you get your body feeling better and movement helps number five do you have plans i realize and i notice that when i have things planned when i have a trip coming up when i have um a meeting uh, a meeting up with some friends, you know, it, 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 it's exciting. It's something to look forward to. That is a big, big one. So, you know, I know I'm busy now. I know I'm busy this month, but I know that at the end of the month, in six weeks, I'm taking a trip. And that gives me a chance to really relax and, and disconnect. So that is a big one. So make plans, guys. Number six. So, of course, you want to spend more time with the loved ones. So these are people who love you no matter what. So spend more time with them. That is quality time. Number seven. So this is a big one. Believe in yourself, okay? And meet up challenges and face up to challenges. That, that's what they are, they are challenges. And when you do, when, when you're challenged, guess what? You get better. 
So it is okay to be challenged. It's okay to face adversity because through that, we get better. Through that, we learn something. We get better. You, you never want to be stagnant. You want to always be progressing. So adversity, change. With change comes progress. Number eight, how about we just focus on the present? Okay, now this is a big, big one. So focusing on, I've talked about this one before. So focus on just the present on now, on what we have now, what you have now. Just be positive about that present. Number nine, get outdoors. So, so important to get your vitamin D. So studies and studies have proven that just getting some sun improves your mood. So let's get out more. Again, it's a fresh air. It helps you to breathe more. Remember, we've talked about breathing. So you want to breathe better. So getting outside is a very important one. So last but not least, number 10. It is a choice, guys. We have to choose. So choose happiness, okay? Nobody, you cannot affect you cannot um, change how things are gonna are gonna come at you, but you can change how you react to them. So it's your choice. So choose to be happy. Choose to be positive, guys. And remember, you are amazing. <laughs>